Okay, here we are again. Uh, I wanted to finish up with a fairly detailed analysis of the noise generated in my HO guitar amplifier. Now, what we're going to look at is... I'll just put it up here first. This... Uh, is... I can get it to come up. Don't break your... Don't drop your oscilloscope probes. If you break your probe, you'll be sad ever after. Okay, finally got it to work. This is the power supply at the top of the anode resistors for the first two gain stages in the HON. One of the things I want you to notice oops, camera, here is it's jumping around a bit, but there's an absence of any spikes here at the switching transient points, especially the off, off transient points. There's just a little bit of noise and, and the voltage seems to fluctuate a little bit. Maybe it's my bad probe. Um, and this is set for maximum sensitivity, one millivolt per division. So there's, uh, there's really very little, it's very smooth power here, with very little uh, fluctuation. Okay. Now you can hear, I've got this amp plugged into the speaker so you can hear um, what's going on. We look at the output of the first tube. Nothing's plugged into the input, so the input's shorted. So you can see transients at the off. Um, switching points and you can see a 120 cycle ripple in the output of the tube but there was no 120 cycle ripple in the supply voltage so it's got to be coming from somewhere it's very interesting um, okay next is we'll look at the output of the second tube And it's, it's amplified version of the first. You can see the transient spikes. There we go. Quick transient spike. All right, moving on look at the signal now. At the master volume. It looks like noise is becoming more granular and we can see switching transients at every off point there pretty well. So, looks like 120 hertz ripple with spikes at the transient points. Now I've switched the tube, the preamp tubes, um, from the last time. These are ruby tubes, and the tube that's in there is highly microphonic, tapping on the tube itself. Although it has less, less noise, as you see. Now, I ran spectrum of this noise that you're hearing now. I can show you a graph of that. Take a look down here at the spectrum analyzer. And that's 100 hertz per uh, division and 10 decibels per division. So we see a spike at 60 hertz, 
and then one that's 20 decibels greater at 120 hertz then all the rest are back down the 15 decibels lower than that 12 uh, it's interesting that third harmonic the odd order harmonics carry on third fifth seventh ninth eleventh thirteenth fifteenth seventeenth harmonic are still it's uh say six to six to eight decibels above the noise floor and they carry on that's from uh, zero to one thousand hertz showing that main spike at 120. Alrighty, that wraps up my examination of noise in this HF. Thanks for watching.